this is Ken from SimpleTutorials.net. I hope you're having a good day. I uh, I wanted to make a quick video here because maybe some other people might every once in a while have the same problem. I was in YouTube and uh, various times today, and then also last night, and I was having problems um, playing the whole video. It would not continue throughout. In fact, it seemed like it was stopping at around one minute, and then other times it would stop in um, you know, other places. Well, I did various things. I got rid of my history in, in Chrome. So ba basically, I use Chrome most of the time. But I also saw that it w videos would play correctly in the browser known as Opera. Um, and I use other browsers too, but I was basically having the problem with Chrome, and I, apparently you can have how also they have the same problem with Firefox. But my problem was with Chrome, and I just could not watch the video throughout. And uh, what I did was I tried to delete all the history. I rebooted the computer. I rebooted my router, uh, modem, various things, and it just would not fix the problem. Of course, I didn't know exactly what the problem was. Well, after doing a little search, I found out on this website, Raymond.cc, that it looks like the shockwave, uh, the the flash files inside inside Chrome, and also the Windows um, operating system. There, they uh, apparently fight each other. What you'd want to do is you copy this and then go into another tab or another window of your Chrome and paste and then hit enter into the URL area and what you'll see is likely what you'll see um, and if you don't see this, see what I saw then you want to go through this and find out what you might want to do. You might want to uninstall and reinstall the flash player so basically what I did was I put that in there, the in the URL, and I hit enter, and what came up was two entries for Shockwave Flash under Adobe Flash Player. Um, basically you want either one or you want one of them to be disabled. And I had them both enabled. So the, the first one was actually, it used to be enabled, but now it's disabled because I disabled it. And after I did that, uh, I was able to watch videos on YouTube successfully. Um, basically, what this uh, website says is that if um, you look for uh, these files, and if you have one of these, I had this one, then you want to disable where the the link the the link would say uh, probably disable, and then you click that, and it changed to enable. And I kn I'm pretty sure I've had this happen a while back, but I just forgot about it. So I hope that helps, and uh, have a good day. Thank you very much. Sim Kent from SimpleTutorials.net.